for the Celtics win at 117 to 113. So you, you heard this uh, this uh, Kyrie Irving story with Tommy Heinsohn, right? No. Tommy no, Heinsohn. Yeah, yeah, I heard Tommy it. Tommy Heinsohn had said on the air that uh, Kyrie looks like he's out of shape. He looks like he's out of sync. And instead of getting mad, he just he said the next day he was in the gym working harder than ever because he, he, he values what a guy like Tommy Heinsohn had to say. I used to do that with you, with you. Not, not them two bums, but you. <laughs> what do you mean? Bums, what, yeah. Do what? Like when y'all used to talk, I, I never listened to what you had to say, but when a guy like Ernie and Craig said something, I say, okay. So, but I never <laughs> critiqued you. We never critiqued you. We critiqued you. Ernie and Craig didn't critique you. Well, they interviewed say uh, stuff. <laughs> you know you were listening to me and Chuck, and you was like, I got No, I never better. listened to you. Uh, you know, I, 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 I love that story. Yeah. <laughs> because, you know, a lot of these young guys today, they think we're haters. Mm -hmm. Like, when Moses told me I was fat and lazy and got me in shape in Philly, I didn't take it as hating on me. He's like, Charles, you can't play fat in the NBA. And Moses, who I called dad, rest his soul, he took me to the gym every day, lost 50 pounds. But it, it was like that in our day, Ernie. But now, anytime you tell a young kid something, oh, you hater, you the old get off my lawn guy, it drives me crazy. You know, what, the, what, I always, what I've learned is that when someone criticizes you and it makes you angry, then I would say most of the time that it's true about you. But when, it, when they criticize you and it's not you, you walk with your shoulders back and your chest out, so it's not like... Question. Yeah. <laughs> What's the difference between criticism and coaching? Well, criticism, coaching is to develop me to be better. Criticism is just to hurt my feelings. Uh, wait, wh wait, really? Coaching is to develop me to be better. So if I might say, Charles, you, you need, you're out of shape and you need to get better, that's coaching. Because I've wanted, I'm saying it because I want you to get better. But if I'm just looking at you and go, well, that's an ugly suit and you're a fat butt. <laughs> fat that, that's, butt. I was that's just criticism. Big, cr See, listen. See, you felt the difference. <laughs> yes. You felt the difference. That's no, but, I, but, but I, see, I find, like, I have this discussion with coaching friends of mine right. all the time. Right. Like, so, what, it's such a fine line. Right, but th that's where the player comes in and he has to go, is, it is this going to make me better? The comment that he's making going to make me better. And if he and says it in a way that you don't like it, but if it's going to make me better, then fine. If someone says something to you with a comment you don't like or the way they say it, but it makes you better person or better player, you have to take it. And it's then, constructive. It's and, constructive yes, criticism. And then a lot of time, criticism comes from those that are non-coaches. But in this case, Tommy Heinsohn has G14 classification oh, to say question. that. He's seen the best. He played on some of the teams. He can say that. 